Hi, I'm Mark Wolbright, and uh, I'm here today to talk about the sustainability or greenness of the Smart Slope Retaining Wall System. Now, you probably already know from looking at some of these other videos that we've shot that Smart Slope is a living retaining wall system. And, um, you know, that alone is a pretty good calling card. And uh, many might think, well, that's, that's as far as we go, but that's pretty good. Well, the ability to hold a lot of soil or growth media in the pocket and uh, have a wide range of plants that you could select to grow the top over and to have a wall system that would verifiably grow itself over is pretty cool. You're creating green space, you're creating habitat, you're also uh, creating a situation where you can hold uh, runoff water on the site, filter the pollutants, let the plants process the nutrients uh, out of the runoff water. Uh, there's a lot of things that, that uh, you know, are advantageous about a living wall system, and that's obvious. Uh, the things that aren't so obvious are what we do with uh, the way we manufacture the module. By using wet pour concrete, we can make an extremely efficient structural block. So we don't have to waste a whole bunch of concrete making it thicker than it needs to to survive the dry cast process. So consequently, Smart Slope is about 80 pounds, covers 1.85 square feet. Well, that turns out to be about 43 pounds per square foot of wall face, which is unprecedented in the wall market. What that means to you is that we get a lot more square footage on the truck, so we ship fewer trucks to the job. Now, that's sustainable. Now, uh, the next thing that we do is we make Smart Slope in a lightweight polymer forming system that can be shipped anywhere in the world. So the actual concrete modules can be cast at or near the job, and that reduces the trucking from the manufacturing point to the job. That's also very good and very sustainable. Uh, another thing that we do with Smart Slope that we're really proud about is we understand the life cycle of the, um, of the forming system. The form itself is designed so that once it's worn out, we can send it back to our processing facility. It can be reground and made into any of our accessory parts or to our liner. So that's pretty smart as well. So there's a whole host of things we're doing with Smart Slope that are different than, than many other systems, and uh, they're very quantifiable. Now, sustainability analysis is something that we're undertaking, and uh, it's very important to us. That job isn't done yet, but it will be shortly. Uh, another thing I might mention is that uh, by, by having this unprecedented weight to coverage ratio that Smart Slope has, Smart Slope uses less concrete than uh, most other systems that we know of. That means less Portland cement, less quarried aggregate, less mined sand, less water. Uh, also at Smart Slope, we are pioneering the use of uh, Portland cement alternatives or synthetic Portland cements. So we're very near to producing modules on a regular basis around the world that uh, hardly use any Portland cement at all to, to maybe possibly no Portland cement. And that drives the carbon footprint down as low as it can possibly be for this type of modular system. So those are just some, some uh, good reasons to, um, to appreciate the Smart Slope system and its uh, efforts at sustainability and its greenness in a market where there are an awful lot of things that say they're green but you know, perhaps maybe not be so green. So thank you very much. I uh, hope you visit our website at smartslope.com and uh, give us a call. Take care.